Hello, hello. What's up, everybody? Welcome back. All right, you guys. So you already know we're about to go ahead and get into jazz. Now, we're not going to be getting into the whole entire live, like starting it from the you know very beginning and going all the way to the end. No, I got some stopping points that we're going to go ahead and go through and de discuss, discuss at this point, because baby, when I tell y'all, listen, it was the lies for me. All right. Somebody need to go ahead and give Jasmine her Oscar. Well, not Oscar. I mean, you know, give her, you know, a bootleg one, bootleg one, because baby. Because, <laughs> whoo, she, go, she, went, she went in on this performance. I'm going to tell y'all something. She went in. But we're gonna go ahead and we're gonna go ahead and throw it back real quick because you know what, Jasmine? Um, how come you can't do what the hell you told us to do? Oh, let me go ahead and refresh a, a few people's minds. Let me go ahead and refresh y'all real quick. And, and all the people, you know, who's been giving Jasmine money these past couple of days. Let me go ahead and jog y'all's memory real quick. Because um, listen, let's go ahead and bring this up real quick. Oh, uh, okay. So let me see. Come with me to help out my supporters. Okay. So let's see what Jasmine's doing in this video. So you guys, I get a lot of questions on a lot of questions like, Jazz, do you have any extra cash? Can you help me out? Like my kids need a little bit of help and we don't, we're running low on food. I get emails like that on a regular. And honestly, you guys, the resources are there. If you need help, as far as food, household items, bills, you get behind on bills. The research. Oh, 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 what was that again? You get behind on bills. The resources are there, Jasmine. Um, have you have you went to these resources before you hopped on live, dry begging and crying, talking about you're behind on bills, you can't afford nothing in your house or whatnot. Oh, did you did you check out these resources before you bought, you bought your big crybaby butt on here, dry begging the people, trying to get Valerie's um allowance? Did you do that? Oh no, no. Let's continue. Resources are there. So that being said, I'm gonna take you guys along with me. We're gonna go to the caring place. They do have resources as far as um food, pantry items. Like I said, household items, stuff you might need around your house. And of course, a bill, if you need a bill that needs to be paid, they will help you with that. But we're about to go across the street. Okay, Jasmine, did you wheel your butt into the carry hands? D did you go there? Did you explore these options, huh? Just like you told us, just like you told somebody, the people who keep on emailing you about their kids or whatever, they need the money for their kids, just like how you on this internet yesterday talking about you need this and you need for your kids. Did you go to your resources or is the people your resources? Because we're not. If we can't depend on you, you shouldn't be able to depend and ask for anything from us. Let's go ahead and um bring up this live video that she did yesterday real quick. <coughs> Excuse me. Okay, so she titled this video, I just want to give up reality of going from a two-person home household to one is financially draining, right? Okay, okay, okay. So let's go ahead and check this out real quick. Ooh, we every ounce, like you know, pills is just I'm drowning, you know. I'm like, damn, you know, <laughs> then I'm having to come out of my pocket and pay for this other shit, the other shit. What other stuff, Jasmine? You told us about the bills. Tell us what else you got. Tell us what you had to come out of pocket for. Nothing. Because if you would have came out of pocket for something else, you would have said it. She too busy worried about what people going to say. Well, got, Jasmine, I mean, come on now. We all got bills. I mean, you know, and then she going to try to add on to it. And I had to come out of pocket for something else. What else? The eateries? Yeah. Your shots? Uh, 
And I just feel like just saying, fuck it all. Just fuck everything. Because it's just so much. It's so much. And it's like people don't understand. What don't the people understand? I, wish I could just up and leave. I wish I had it that way. I wish I had had a lot of stuff. Like, but in reality, like you gotta see it as that you do this shit by yourself. Literally, like there is no motherfucking help when it comes to anything. And I just want to leave, but I can't. Because where the fuck am I gonna go? Because no one's gonna accept me. No apartments would even accept my fucking shit. And I don't have three, four fucking rent monies to pay. You had it a couple months ago, tax time. Well, I'm confused. You had it your February check from YouTube because you got a whole lot of money from YouTube for um, your videos in January. You remember January 2nd, that video got over, what, 30,000 um, views on that? And then after that, your views was high. So your January check that you received in February was good. Your February check that you received in March was good. So what happened to all of that money, Jasmine? You had a, thousands upon thousands of dollars from your taxes, thousands upon thousands of dollars from YouTube. Where did that money go? Down payment for, for a house. So I'm stuck in a fucking house that I'm struggling to fucking live in every fucking month. Where's your taxes go? Bitch, I used to, I caught up on fucking bills. Shit was so far behind. Every Here we go with the lies. Here we go with the lies. I'm confused, Jasmine. You know what? This girl... Jasmine, you you trying to tell us every adult who's sitting here watching you, you trying to play in our faces, going to try to say you caught up on bills, Jasmine, these utility companies, they're not about to let you be three months behind, four months behind, Jasmine. They're not about to do that before they start disconnecting your stuff. All right. They're not about to let you get that far behind. Shut it up. Shut it up. What are you talking about? After you done came on here January 2nd and you got your, the people came together, they helped you with the rest of your rent, right? You received a whole bunch of money. You had a whole bunch of money left over. Girl, you you had about $1,500 to $2,000 in cash outs from the people. You told us after that, Jasmine, you don't remember that you used the rest of that money on your bills. That's what the fuck you said, Jasmine. That was the first week of January you told us this. With the remaining money from the cash apps that people sent you, you got caught up on bills. So what the fuck are you saying? Taxes dropped what? Late February, early March? And you was behind one month, Jasmine? Stop it. Cut it out. Cut it out. You, I'm, I'm confused. You didn't even pay up. You didn't, you, you didn't do what usually what women do with, with their taxes. Pay up on their rent for at least a couple of months. You didn't even do that. Everything is fucking behind. But I just always like fuck. I rather have no lights and at least have a place to stay. Or I'd rather have no water and have a place to stay. I'll figure it out once I, I hit that road. You know? When they figure it out, because we all, every, all of us gotta figure it out, Jasmine. You, she coming on here like she the only single mom out here in a household having to do everything by herself. I just feel like you have a I knew my life was going to be like this. Jasmine, shut your dumb self up. Let's go ahead and skip ahead real quick. Where is it at? Where is it at? Okay, it's right here. Start right here. Okay, what's going on? I just got paid and I'm broke. Like, and I just got paid and, bitch, when I say I'm broke, I'm fucking, and it's just like, I got to hustle, try to figure out how to pull money, you know what I'm saying? Like, I got to do what I have to do, but 
I'm just like, God damn. Okay, you're telling us four. Why are you telling us? Why are you telling us, Jasmine? Hold on, y'all. I'm going to bring that right back up real quick because I'm confused. Why are you telling us that... Um, I mean, why are you telling us that you're broke? And that you have to hustle up money. Ain't that... Don't... Isn't that what you got to do if you don't got no money? An unexpected expense hits you and you don't have no money? Okay, you get your butt out there and hustle. Tell us what the fuck you doing. Tell us what are you doing? Or what? Instacart, DoorDash. Uh, well, she probably don't want to say what she doing because she thinks people are going to be calling. So she, you can easily say, okay, I'm doing one of those driving apps. That's it. But tell us what the fuck you doing to hustle. Oh, okay. No, this is considered your hustle, right? Coming on here begging the people. Oh, uh, okay. No, dry bagging. Got it. Matter of fact, ask, ask all the adults, Jasmine, what do they do when they're broke and they need more money? What do they do, Jasmine? You know you're going to be broke before you're, at, before you're actually broke. You know this, right? This ain't your first rodeo with being broke. Girl, you're always broke. I mean, what? So what do, what do adults do, Jasmine? They go out there and they get a job. That's what the hell they do. Oh, you don't got nobody to watch Legend? Okay, okay. You go out there and you work for Instacart. You work for DoorDash. Uber Eats. You do something. Instead of just sitting up here begging and crying. For one thing, I'm always going to make sure I got my fucking rent. <laughs> I'll be broke. I don't even, I hate asking family because I already know the answer when it comes to asking family. It's just what I'm like asking nobody really like shit. Yeah, you already know the answer. You want to know why? Y'all want to know why Jasmine already knows the answer for when she asks her family? Because she owes them money. Yeah, yeah. She exhausted them out. They're not about to keep on finding, helping you, Jasmine, your overgrown self. You're able to go out there and get a job just like they do. They have their own households that they have to support. They tired to keep on giving you money and doing everything for you. You're too old. You're too old. Grow up. But, you know. You know a bitch is desperate when they ask, you ask your family. Your family, like I. <laughs> now here she go trying to throw her family under the bus. Like y'all know I'm desperate. If I'm asking y'all for some money, then I need some money. Oh no, they're trying to teach you a lesson, Jasmine. Get your lazy butt up and go out there and get it, just like they are. Just like other single mothers in households do, Jasmine. They go out there and get it. I'm confused. What you're not catching on to? People are tired of footing the bill for you. You have five kids in the house. Four kids. They're gone majority of the time. Their dad pays child support. I don't give a fuck if he was paying one dollar. You still getting it. You have another son right there. The daddy ain't paying child support. The daddy's not doing nothing for that little boy. Why, why would you come to the people and dry bag us when you could go to his daddy? You could go down there to the courts and put their daddy on child support. Then you know what you're going to get back. You know a bitch is desperate. I'm talking about like my immediate family, like my mom and dad. I don't even, I don't like asking them shit, nobody anything. Oh, but you like to come on here and dry bag us, us nine to fivers, right? Oh, okay. Go, go, go on somewhere, go on somewhere. The fuck? You do YouTube, remember? 
you big money over there. Us nine to fivers can't compare. Can you look at the chat? You can see the chat. Let me speed this up real quick. Let me see. Let me see where we're going to stop right here. Now, you know what? When I call a little bit of this. Get another job. Hold on. Oh, shit. Damn it. <laughs> uh, let me go back right here. Okay. So when I call, call a little bit of this, I read somebody said in the comments, they was like, we knew this video was coming. Oh, <laughs> I was out when I read that. I was done. I was dead. <laughs> It was like we knew this video was coming because we knew. Goodness, this girl is so predictable, it's crazy. But let's go ahead and listen to this mess. Get another job. Uh, it's so much that I don't even tell social media. <laughs> oh, but I thought that you was open. Get another job. I thought that you was the one, the only chick on YouTube who who, who shared everything. Oh, but you're not sharing us with us about the job, right? Girl, like go. I said, it goes back to if I knew what situation I was going to be in, if I could go and look at my future, I would have made different decisions. Like some stuff is just not. I thought it was hard when I had my, just my older four, you know, because I had the twins at home and I didn't have anyone. No one ever wanted to watch anybody. I thought it was hard then. And I feel like I'm back at square, back at square one, but we're just one now. You know, the older ones are in school, but I'm back at square one. Yeah, Jasmine, put his ass in daycare. Do that. That's simple. Put him in daycare. Talking about don't nobody want to watch you. That's your problem. You want stuff to be done for free. No, nobody's not about to sit around here and watch no crybaby kid for free. They're taking time out of their day to watch your child. All right. He's a toddler. They have to they they have to look out and see what the hell he's doing. He ain't no damn teenager to where they could go sit down and you know be on the phone or you know going away, going about their business. He's a toddler. Somebody has to keep their eyes on him at all times, Jasmine. You want you want your family to watch this little boy for free? No, you ain't getting nothing for free. Sign his butt. Sign his butt up for daycare. You can do that. And it's like, even though I applied for jobs, I I be asking myself, Jazz, what the fuck you gonna do with Legend if you get if one of these jobs call you back and say, come on, what you gonna do, bitch? <laughs> Put them in daycare. You're, you get you get food stamps. You qualify for free child care. I don't see that's the thing, like I know I'm not talking about it, I'm just talking about it. I just don't want so I know how people are. That's another thing. Like being a content creator is it could be a gift and it can be a curse. I don't really want to say, hey, yeah, help me with this, you know, because I really am struggling. But like I said, it's a curse too. Because then people will take what you say because you can say, oh, you ask your supporters for help. You're begging. You're doing this. But in reality, it's like. <laughs> so I just don't even tell no one what I need help with. Just... You just told us, Jasmine. You said that you were broke. You said you got bills to pay. You said that you can barely afford your rent. You already told us this, Jasmine. Well, hello. I mean, what's going on up there? What's going on up there? Knock, knock. Is anybody up there? I'm confused. Like what? You don't have to verbally say it out your mouth. Oh, you guys, can you can you um help me with this bill right here? I got it right here. It's um uh, $79.85. No, no, you're dry begging. 
You're telling us what you got to pay in hopes that somebody will send you cash apps. That's what you're doing, Jasmine. You know what the fuck you're doing. You're the queen of it. If someone decides, now I can't say someone like I, someone messaged me and said something. Someone decides to donate like that or whatever. That's, you know, I appreciate it. I don't want to get on here and say, I need help with this. I need help with that. See, th there we go right there. You, you just told them what they can do. But if somebody wants to message me, you know, um, yeah, they can go ahead and donate and stuff. No, if you're not coming on here begging, you should say, no, I don't want none of y'all's money. I got it handled. I'm going to do what it do. Y'all keep y'all's money. Don't nobody cash at me nothing. There was people going, um, some stupid hoe named Jackie flashing um, Jasmine's cash app. How the hell you know her cash app? Okay, that's an undercover mod for Jazz. Trying to act like just a regular person. Stop it. Just come out of nowhere and you know the cash app. Talking about it, everybody, come on and donate. Okay, that's Korean's undercover um page right there. Like, stop. The fuck, if you're not on here back and tell them people don't send you nothing in. Like, right now I'm just venting, you know. It's just a lot. And I feel like it's overwhelming me. Like, I feel overwhelmed with everything, you know. And Welcome so, to life. I'd rather vent and just get it off my chest really well you can vent and say that you don't want nobody to send you nothing vent and do that but i do appreciate it okay dm me about the job what is it dm you and you don't respond cut it out the fuck just trying to get somebody to shut up i had a allergic reaction we don't care next I wish you would wish the best for you. Thank you. It's not that YouTube isn't cutting. It's just these bills. It's just, y'all, it's just, I went from being good to just like, it's like, once my rent went up, it's just, this shit is hard. You, you act like your rent went up $700 overnight, Jasmine. Shut it up. No, it did not. Talking about, well, it's just not, it's not YouTube is not cutting it. It's just these bills are too much. That means YouTube is not cutting it, Jasmine. Hello, are you here with us? Do you comprehend? I'm confused. I'm trying to figure out what language does this girl speak? I mean, maybe the language of stupid. That's just all I could think of. Because you know what? At this point, I don't, I'm confused. If you're not able to pay your bills and your rent and also have money on the side to save up but also have money in your pocket then youtube is not cutting it idiot it's not cutting it what does that mean you have to go out there and get another job right oh okay you have to find something to bring in more money right okay And it's like, I don't want to renew my lease. Then don't. But it's like, because what did I think? I'm like, what if I renew my lease again? And that bitch go up again. Because he said it was supposed to increase my last time I renewed it. And I'm like, bro, this shit's already fucking a lot. Like, can it, can it, is that possible for it to increase like that every time? Like, Yes, Jasmine, it's possible. When the lease is over, they can up the rent. Yes, yes. You sign the lease for the new rent, I mean, for the new year, and you're signing, and if it's if they want to put it $2,500 a month, you sign it, that's on you. That's on you. You knew how much the rent was when you signed it last year. It didn't go up last year. You just said that it did not go up. They told you that they were supposed to up the rent, but it did not go up. So that rent has been the same amount since you move in, since when you first moved in, because you've been in this house for what, two years? Oh, okay. Talking about your rent and went up. Girl, bye. Rent is taking the majority of my check, of course. I do. normal, but it's taking a big portion of it. Like,
what your high is. Whenever you make it a certain amount of money, even shark flex. When I did work a nine to five, I worked a nine to five and I worked overtime and I honestly, and I'm just sitting here thinking like, I wouldn't even be able to, I think I'm struggling now. Like people try to compare social media to some nine to fives and I'm just like, I wouldn't even be able to live here. I would get evicted. I wouldn't even be able to pay for rent. I remember how much I was making and it's just, it would have been no way when I was working those jobs and with overtime, I wouldn't have been able to Why this girl so slow? live in the environment that I'm in. Why is this girl so slow? You know what people telling you. Stop being dumb. Stop being stupid. Like, Jasmine is, in her mind, she thinking people telling her to, no, she knows what the people are saying. They're telling you to get a job and also do YouTube. Get a job and also do YouTube and you will be good. Not quit YouTube and go get a job, Jasmine. That's not what people saying. Oh, my bad. I forgot what I was about to say. I mean, maybe a one bedroom. Maybe I'll be pushing it for two. Oh, wow. I wouldn't even have been able to afford the apartment that I was in before this, working a nine to five. And I worked, like I said, I worked overtime. I worked extra. Jasmine talking about a paycheck from how many years ago? The fuck? What, 12 years ago, Jasmine? Pay has changed since 12, 12 years ago, Jasmine. Pay has changed. You're not going to be still making the same $12 that you made back then. Goodness. Just admit you don't want to work. I just... I'm just done answering that. I'm yeah, admit that you don't want to work, Jasmine. That's what it is. Every time somebody mentions a job, this girl always has an excuse. Always has an excuse for why she doesn't want to work. Just say you don't want to get a job. Say that then. Don't run down all of these excuses that you're trying to make. I don't get it. Nobody's stupid like you. Nobody believes you. I never said I didn't want to work. What the hell? You don't, <laughs> dummy. Where's the job at? Where is the job, Jasmine? You're not even attempting to go out there and do one of those um car jobs, Instacart, DoorDash, Uber Eats, all of those things that you could get money right then and there instead of bringing your sorry ass on YouTube to cry and dry bag. Dang, do you, I mean, gosh, do you have any respect for yourself? I don't get it. And the people who's actually believing Jasmine don't have no money, She's getting way more money than her dang on rent in these YouTube checks that she received. Best believe it. So I wouldn't just quit YouTube. I would, of course, do more, but... It's just I gotta try yeah, to they do it. I have to get a job, and then on top of that, I gotta find out where he will be able to go. It ain't like how what you waiting on. Can just let me work on the days that you're not working Mommy. and do stuff. The what day you? that you're not working Mommy, so that you, you ah. Jasmine, you was with Chris for what two, three years? You still didn't get a job. So what are you talking about? Oh wow. Ugh. Sorry. Let's do it again, guys. Damn. 
Minnesota. Hurry up, Jasmine. If the one kid, Jazz, you can find that care is part-time, that's just another bill, another heavy, heavy bill. You know what? I'm getting so sick and tired of this girl. So, Jasmine, what the hell do you want us to do? Tell us what the hell you want us to do. What are we supposed to do? Everybody's giving you all these damn um, solutions to your problems, and you don't want to take none of it. But your dumb ass will take some a cash app, though. You damn sure will take a dang on cash app. I, I don't understand it. I don't get it. People need to stop enabling this type of behavior. They have to stop enabling this behavior. It's crazy. I'm trying to see. Hold on. I'm going too fast. I don't even want to talk about this, but he does send me money. I don't even want to talk about it because he sends money. I lost my food stamps. So I had to use the money that he sent that I could use for a bill and buy food. Jasmine, why are you lying? <laughs> Y'all remember. Right when she cleaned out the deep freezer, right, and she lost all of that um, all of that um, all of that food. Let me just go ahead and rewind this back just to make sure that I heard it right. I'm trying to see. Hold on, it went too fast. I don't even want to talk about this, but he does send me money. I don't even want to talk about it because he sends money. I lost my food stamps. So I had to use the money that he sent that I could use for a bill and buy food. Okay, so she's not talking about when the freezer had broke down. She's talking about when she came on here and she told us that she had to go to the food stamp office. Y'all remember that, right? Jasmine, he did not give you no money. Stop it. Stop it. Y'all know what Chris did, did? He called her up, told, told, um, you know, she actually went the one time, most recently, what was it, a couple weeks ago when he talked to Legend on FaceTime, and um, she was like, people keep asking about you. What do you want me to say? Um, he said, just tell him I'm taking care of my kid. Tell him something good. Tell him I'm giving you money or something. Don't be just making me out here, have me out here looking crazy. No, Chris, you are crazy. You're a deadbeat bum. All right, Jasmine. Stop fucking lying. He don't give you nothing. He hasn't give, given you anything. Stupid. Stop lying for this weird dude. Stop. He's a loser and so are you. A loser that's never going to come back to you unless he needs a place to stay. Dummy. Get it through your head. I don't get it. I don't understand it. Lie for what? Lie for what? Just to try to make him look good? And then what? I guarantee a couple months from now, she'll be like, oh, I was just lying. I was just saying all that stuff because he wanted me to say it and stuff like that. He don't help with legend. He haven't been doing nothing. Guarantee it's going to be like that. Guarantee it. <coughs> when Jasmine uh, went down to the food stamp office, girl, you still had a deep freezer full of food. So stop playing. Stop playing. All right. Oh, no, what? You was in dire need to go get some food, um, to go get your food stamps for what? Because Chris needed some to borrow some of your food stamps. He was buying some from you, not you gave him some. Yes. We did agree upon a, a number, and it's just in reality, it's like that's yeah. not how, like you don't get nothing from my rent is so fucking much like that's nothing the light bill is be expensive as fuck water it's so different i didn't know until i moved into a house but it's a big difference Mommy to live in a house and apartment when it comes to water the water bill why the hell she's speaking to us like we don't we don't we don't pay bills i don't understand it why is she sitting here speaking to us like we're children 
<laughs> like, girl, everybody who watches you, they're, they're paying bills, Jasmine. We all have it. The gas, electric, water, cable. Some people got, I don't have cable. I like to just use the streaming sites. You know, people got like Netflix and all of that stuff that they pay for, streaming services, internet. I mean, Jasmine, everybody has bills, mortgage, rent, whatever. We're not new to this. I mean, what? A lot of people's bills are high as hell. Okay, and what? When it comes to water and it comes to the light bill, it's a big fucking difference. Who cares? And all the extra expenses. Figure it out. I, I'm getting child support tomorrow. And I'm going to use that and put it on a bill, the entire check. The entire fucking check. I'm going to use it and put it on a bill. Now, y'all know what? Because I don't know if I have a stopping point for this, but later on in this video, this idiot just when she just sat here and just um later on in this video, this idiot lies, right? She says that later on that she does not spend none of the child support money on herself or paying bills. What did we just hear just now? We just heard her say that when the, the child support check that's coming tomorrow, she's going to put all of that on a bill. But later on in this video, she says that she she, she thinks that she has a hard time, you know, spending the child support on herself. She spends it on her kids. Boom. How you how stupid are you? I mean, to tell a lie. After you done told us what you was going to do with the child support check, Jasmine. Goodness. Let's get to the next one. Let me see what's coming up? Okay, I just answered that. Answer what y'all wanted to know about child support money coming from him. Answer it again. Uh oh. We'll get to work. I am working. This what are you talking about, Jasmine? You know what the fuck they saying? Talking about some I am working. Well, this work that you're doing is not covering everything. So maybe you need to go seek work elsewhere then as well. Yeah, but I'm just saying use it directly on them. Thank you for subscribing. Then get a real job. I just broke down what a whole real job would do. Um, see whatever. You have to go back and watch a little bit more of my video. Then you can come back and comment. Okay, Jasmine, then come up with the solution since you all you doing is sitting here want to cry. Listen to overcomers when you get a chance. And some gospel. Fucking frustrating. Like, oh, it's just so frustrating. It, it, I don't. I can't even tell y'all what happened. I I just know that I didn't have him for a while, and I had already bought food with the money that he sent me. And then when I finally got him, it was just like, damn, now I have him. And I bought. I used to use that money for something else, but just know the whole we renew them the process is just it's a process it's a stressful process she wants us to believe that chris gave her money for food but he could not give her money five hundred dollars to pay her rent to keep her in that house she wants us to believe that chris will give her money and he didn't even want to fucking pay the rent for December. She had to pay him back. But she will sit up here and lie and really want us to believe that he gave her some money for some food. Stop it. Girl, be quiet. You ask him for money for food, he will straight up tell you, go ask Philip. Four of his kids over there, why the fuck you asking me? I'm not going to give you nothing. Dummy. The hell?
During his whole entire time that he lived with Jasmine, he has not took Legend anywhere by himself. He has not watched Legend at all. Jasmine admitted to where she had to sneak up out the house and leave Legend with him. Okay? He's done nothing for Legend. Hasn't bought him anything. He treats Legend just like he treats his other kids. And you want us to sit up here and believe that he gave you some money for some food. Girl, stop it. That's yeah. renewing them. And sometimes shit get messed up. Like, they forget, to, they don't. And I've renewed, I always try to get my stuff in on time. I'm the type of person, I want to get it in way before time. So that they're. If you no, what happened was with Jasmine in the renewal of the food stamps, they sent her out a letter because they send you out a letter ahead of time so that you can gather your shit up and get it in. They sent her out a letter. She, she probably didn't even open the mail. She probably did open it and put it aside and thought that she was going to remember to do it. The time came around. It came and passed. When it was food stamp day to get her food stamps on her card, she checked it. She didn't hear. She didn't. Um. She didn't hear the balance. So she's calling them like, "What's going on?" They said, "You have to turn in the paper and give us your uh, most recent pay stubs or whatever the hell for your income is." Jasmine submitted the, submitted the stuff in and thought that it was just going to click on just like that. No, no, it don't work like that. You miss your renewal day, you gonna wait. You gonna wait on their time unless you go down there. And that's what Jasmine had to do. She had to go down there and that's when they cut on her stuff. So stop it. Talking about it's a lot of, girl, stop. You you didn't do, you didn't make the date. It came and went and you thought that you still had your food stamps. Nope. If you, there's something they'll call. They didn't call. Nobody called. They don't call you, stupid. The fuck? Why would they call you, Jasmine? No. They sent you out a letter. They don't have time to call 50,000 people and talk about, okay, well, you know, you know, your, your renewal date is up. So um, what you what you trying to do? I'm just reminding you, calling you. No, Jasmine, it, it don't work like that. You know it. Oh, no one said anything. They just denied it. So I called and I was like, so what? I get night for the lady said she don't know. She couldn't figure it out. She's like, you turned in everything extra early. I don't I don't even get it. Girl, it's the up. same. Everything's still the same. So I went. Oh, I had it went up there twice. They did a sentence of escalations. Still took a while for me to get them. And no, you know, and they were supposed to call me and no one actually called. I just so happened to check one day and I was like, oh wow, they're on here now. <laughs> no one called. They're supposed to call because they got sent to escalations. And it was just dumb as fuck. All right, let's skip along. It's what? It's not stressful. Reapply. Okay. Some people just be commenting. I'm just don't know. <laughs> <laughs> ah, they said it's not stressful. Just reapply. <laughs> that pissed her off. I'm done. So I don't know what this one is for. I didn't write this one down. Let me see. I'm ignoring child support for Chris. I already responded to that. You can go back in the beginning. A lot of questions I already responded to like three times. Well, answer it again. You afraid that you might lie? You you can't remember what you just said at the beginning. Stop. Oh, funny. Too 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 Thank you. She said someone sent a super chat. Thank you for the super chat. Can't got idiots sending super chats to this oh, house. Right, right, I don't know why. It, well, it's different. Okay. 
I don't even can I, can I see more. I only see one. She said someone sent it. I just hearted it. Thank you. That's different. You're making this because everyone else struggles. I'm not making it. So a person making an excuse wouldn't be working. But I'm sitting on here in front of 680 yeah. people telling y'all that I'm struggling. But at the same time, I'm still working. No, Jasmine. Your dumb butt is sitting up here in front of 600 people. Now you done sat up here in front of 16,000 people crying your eyes out talking about your struggling because you don't you barely have enough for rent your bills are high as hell but you don't want to do nothing about it you're a high host of receiving super chats cash apps and everything from the people uh old ladies allowances ssi checks girl goodness gracious i mean and these suckers are sitting here falling for it you send her money. I don't care. You're a sucker. You're a sucker. How many times have Jasmine already been through this? This whole life being broke. So let her stay broke then. Let her stay broke. She still have yet to learn her lesson. I mean, I'm, I'm, I'm not understanding it. What? She acts like she is the only mother out here in a household that's taking care of everything themselves. Jasmine, you're not the only motherfucking mother. The, uh, damn near every uh, majority everybody watching you is single mothers come on now come on the fuck you know being a content creator it, you think it's as easy as it is but it's really Hi, not mommy, I, you. I love you too nobody didn't say it was nobody said it was it wasn't um easy i mean that it was easy jasmine it take a lot to get on this motherfucking platform and drive back and talk and cry one vlog two edit stupid. three especially when you're in like the most fucked up head space you don't want to fucking do nothing because you're struggling your mind is somewhere else and you're like you can't really think straight it take a lot but at the end of the day, I am working. Whether people see that or not, they don't take what I do serious, being a content creator, for example. Um, but I still am working. My rent is too. But being a content creator, Jasmine, it's not paying the bills. This is what people are trying to get you to understand. What don't you understand about it? Shit, hell, I don't motherfucking know. Being a content creator is not paying the bills. All right? It's not. Oh my goodness gracious. I can't, I can't keep on doing this. Mm -mm. 2,300 or 400. And so I pay my bills. Okay. I'm not sitting here saying that it's easy because I hustle and I'm not asking no one for no money. I'm going to say that again. I'm not on here asking no one for no any money. I am just venting about how stressful it is taking on these kind of bills that were meant for a two-person household and making it a one-person situation explaining how hard this shit is this okay shit. how about you vent your ass and, and say i don't want none of y'all super chats i don't want nobody sending me no cash apps i'm just here to vent and you keep on saying it matter of fact you have your mods run that shit through the whole entire live then since you ain't up here asking nobody for nothing shit ain't easy yes i do wish i would have did things differently it's wednesday differently but it's too late yeah. this is my life this is my reality this is what i go through well, That's what I deal, it with. And deal with it but at the same time i know what i do i know what my job is so a lot of people gonna sit here and say that I'm begging, but I'm really not. I'm sitting here telling y'all my my life, my story, my struggles, but I am working. Just like you would go to your best friend and talk to them about, girl, I'm I'm broke. I had to get a, a payday loan. And you're venting. You're venting, but you're still working. Did you get a loan, Jasmine? Did you get one? Or you looking for a loan from the people? You looking for a grant from the people? That's what you're looking for. You're looking for something that, that you don't have to pay back because you're not going to pay it back. That's what it is. And that's why your family don't mess with you. 
getting up at love you too every morning and working i'm still fucking working do i want to do this do i want to be on live and work no because my mind like i said my mind is just so off i don't want to but you don't do in that. reality i gotta do what i gotta do so i am working my sole income was not meant to be for a house like this by myself that's your fault that's reality you're everything was supposed me. to be stop you, you know stuff was supposed to be split yeah, i'm doing it all by my fucking self okay Join the i club. am working my ass off i'm trying and i'm coming on here even when i don't want to fucking come you're not working your ass off jasmine because if you was working your ass off you'll be in somebody's damn um building working your butt off that's what you would be doing or you'll be delivering somebody's um groceries or food that will be working your butt off not sitting on youtube not editing and doing videos for youtube only you'll be out here doing two jobs youtube and a job you can come on live and deal with some of these dumbass people in the comments because sometimes i'm human so these motherfuckers be doing too much some people do too much. They talk too much shit and they just be like, shut the fuck I want to be like, shut the fuck up. Sometimes y'all just got to shut the fuck up. But that's what we want to say to you, you overgrown, stupid, dumbass bitch. That's what the fuck we want to say to you, Jasmine. That's what we want to say to you. You act like you the only person. I mean, what? We, girl, stop playing. Stop playing. Wow. Okay, what? That's your fault you moved into that house. You're living beyond your means. There's no way that you should be moving into a house with your significant other and if and you're not able to pay the rent by yourself. There's absolutely no way you should not be living in there. There's no guarantee that he's going to be around stupid. You just thought that he would. You thought he was going to stay with you forever. I'm confused. I'm, I'm still my I'm listen. I'm still confused as to why she would think that. I mean, his MO says it all. <laughs> I mean, come on. Fuck up. Y'all don't know what the fuck you're talking about. We do. But YouTube is a job. I am fucking working. I am working. Whether you want to see that or not, I am working. <sighs> I don't ever had a PPP loan. I don't know who said that. Oh, child, she said you, you need real friends. I do have real friends, but I'm at work. You don't get what I'm saying. I get it. You don't, you're not comprehending, but it's okay. No, you're not comprehending because instead of venting to people, you could be calling up your friends and venting to them. How come you're not doing that, Jasmine? Oh, right, because you don't have friends. They tired of hearing about it. That I mean, goodness gracious, y'all, just imagine your friend constantly calling you up. I don't care. I don't. I don't give a fuck if it's the first time you don't call me up. I don't want to hear no depressing ass shit. Okay, you want to um let me know before you tell me. Like, okay, I'm about to tell you about this, and I don't know if you're ready for it. No, I don't want to hear about it. I'm trying to remain in good and high spirits right now. I'm not trying to hear no depressing bullshit, no negativity. I'm not trying to do it. I got my own problems. Don't lay yours on me. The world don't need to know all your business, but I like let's be real, love. Like I've been on this platform for a while. The world's gonna know my if I choose to make my money by telling my business. I'm gonna continue. I'm not gonna just stop there. This is my job. I tell y'all, y'all are in my business on a regular, every motherfucking day basis. Motherfuckers is looking up where I'm staying. I don't post nothing. They come into my house taking pictures, so they're gonna be in my business regardless. Cause that's just what I signed up for from the get go. My brother works. Girl, nothing wrong with these people. Let the people talk. Nothing wrong with your supporters being there for you if you decide to. That's well. Thank you, love. She's saying you don't. 
Yeah, stupid supporters. That's what they are. Stupid supporters. The fuck? I mean, come on now. You don't have to tell all. Okay. Thank y'all. I guess my brother got engaged. Okay, why ain't this coming up? Hurry up, hurry up. Just know you're not alone. It's her choice. Thank y'all. She doesn't have to live. How you get that money. She's telling that you have been giving. They have been giving you what? Damn, it's going too fast. Legend. Okay, that's it of this hoe. That, that's it. That's it. That's it. Bye, girl, whoever. The fuck? No, I don't got time for that bullshit. Like, oh, I came with the stupidity. I mean, Jasmine, how come you can't do what you told us to do? Huh? We drive back to you. You don't still open up your pockets. What happened to that giveaway that you said that you was going to do? I, oh, yeah, she did mention that giveaway recently. She said, you guys, I'm not able to do a giveaway. I have kids I have to take care of. All my money goes towards my kids. Well, where the fuck you think our money goes to, Jasmine? You, you out here thinking that we don't have bills to pay. We don't all have mortgage or rents to pay. We don't have kids or families to take care of. Where do you think our money goes to? For some reason, she thinks everybody else out here is, you know, saving every dime and nickel that they get. And they just have it to go ahead and throw at her or throw at her cash apps. We're not doing that, Jasmine. We have responsibilities just like you. Let me go ahead and um re re remind Jasmine um the same thing of what she told us to do. Here you go. Just in case if you need to know the pantry that you took, um, I mean that you went to. So you guys, go. I get a lot of questions on a lot of questions like Jazz, do you have any extra cash? Can you help me out? Like my kids need a little bit of help and we don't we're running low on food. I get emails like that on a regular. And honestly, you guys. The resources are there if you need help as far as food, household items, bills, you get behind on bills. The resources are there. So that being said, I'm going to take you guys along with me. We're going to go to the caring place. They do have resources as far as um, food. Okay, Jasmine. So there you have it. The Wheel your ass down there with your wagon to the caring place. And there you go. G get your resources that way. You behind on the bill, go there. You need food? Go there. Don't come to us no more. We don't care. We're not trying to hear it. We saw you getting those damn shots. We saw you at every eatery around town for no damn reason, spending about five to eight dollars on a damn smoothie. Yeah, we seen that. You had money there, so you got money now. Goodbye. All right, you guys. <laughs> Go ahead and like this video, comment your thoughts down below, and subscribe if you have yet to do so. We at 4300. All right. Catch you guys later. Peace.